Shay 45 is the morning after, and I'm Angela Yee, and Trina is here with me this morning. Trina, this is yes. so exciting because I'm actually a big Trina fan as well. You are? Yeah, I always have been ever uh, since you first came you out. Say that when I come to it's you true. That's how you know I'm not lying. Yeah. <laughs> all right, so there's so many things that, look, I have all these notes that I wrote down because there's so many things I want to ask you about. Mm -hmm. But I'm not going to get all in your business because I know you don't like that. <laughs> but just a little bit, you know okay. what I'm saying? I'm all right, so first off, I, I was reading about you um, being in the process of adopting, you know, a child. Are you still in the process of doing that? Um, I actually, that was like really twisted up, that whole story about the adoption of a child. Mm -hmm. I was doing an interview live and um, I was asked, what do I feel about adoption? How do I feel about adoption? And what do I feel about the state of Haiti at this moment? And if, you know, so many celebrities and people adopt kids from all over the world and what would I feel, I mean, how do I feel about adopting a child? And if so, would it be Haiti? Right. At this time. So you're like, yeah. And I was like, oh, wow. You know, I never thought of it like that. I was like, I'm, you know, I, I applaud those that do adopt kids. I mean, I think everybody needs love and that affection. And I, I just said, wow, I never thought of it. But, you know, if adoption is for you, that could be cool. Right. I didn't actually say I was going to adopt a child. <laughs> well, you adopted a lot of kids, it seems like, because your foundation is also going really well. The Diamond Doll Foundation is doing really, really great. Um, I'm doing... Uh, something for the foundation I believe it's in May mm -hmm. um, and it's usually like 15 to 1500 to 2000 girls okay. that show up and basically what it is we have a panel we just sit and we talk about a bunch of different stuff from sex to teenage pregnancy drug and alcoholism molestation just uh, self-motivation just uplifting the girls a lot of the girls are in school so they ask a lot of questions right. and believe it or not most of them are really really young and when you have girls that's 13 and to, from the ages of 13 years old to and up, and they want to know some of the questions that they want to know. It's like, wow, you know, and being from the streets and being from the city, of inner city myself, and I'm able to relate to some of the things they want to know, and I just wanted to, the, the purpose of the foundation is to actually just give back and let the girls know that we've all been in the same situation. Like, I come from where you come from, so I understand, and, you know, I'm no better than you. I, I, you just have to structure your life a certain way and be focused and just kind of help self-motivate them. Do you remember when you first learned, like, what sex was and everything? Yeah. <laughs> and how, how you found out about it? Uh -huh. How did you find out about, <laughs> about sex? Wow. Um. <laughs> did you see, like, a porno tape? Did you catch people having sex? Like, how does that happen? I think it was me and my friends was being fast a little bit, and we actually was at one of my friends' house, and her brother actually was is older, and he had this... Uh, a, 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 move, a book, a magazine of just all, just sex. Right. And we started flipping through it and looking through it, and I was just like, I don't think we should be looking at this. Oh, God. And, but everybody was just like, hmm, I need a boyfriend, you know, kind of thing. But it was really fun. Right. It was really fun. <laughs> what a way to find out about sex. Did you ever have to ask, like, your parents, you know? Oh, no. I would, they have I would, to talk with you? <laughs> no, it was mostly me. I probably, I went to, like, my god sister which is like my best friend mm -hmm. and just me and my girls we would talk about it. i didn't really go to like my mom or anything about it i think when i got my first boyfriend my, i kind of was like okay mom you know what like, you were doing yeah what are you doing what are you <laughs> i need to watch every moment i was like no 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 it's cool but yeah okay. i know why moms have to watch you no yeah it's interesting <laughs> how people like learn about what mm -hmm. sex is because mm -hmm. i remember the first time somebody tried to like tongue kiss me and i didn't know what it was and I thought it was the most disgusting thing, thing. in the world. Yeah. I was like, why is this boy just looking... wet and nasty. Yeah, and my mouth. I still kind of think that. Um, <laughs> all right, so Million Dollar Girl, right? Your first mm -hmm. song that you just did the video for. Mm -hmm. It's kind of dancey. Mm -hmm. And a lot of producers now have been saying that, you know, it's all about dance music. And mm -hmm. people aren't in, as into hip-hop as they used to be. Like, Timbaland said he's not even really doing hip-hop anymore. Mm -hmm. And even, like they said, Dr. Dre is doing... You know, a dance yes. song, an Akon with Lady Gaga. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like yours, is your album going to be, like, very dancing? I got a lot of dance music on it. I just feel like with just music and the, and the change, and it's about fun. When you go to the clubs, when you're out partying, you want to hear records that make you dance and have a great time. And you don't want to be just sitting up in a corner and hearing somebody's life story and yes. it's just real depressing and you just want to have a good time and I think just the whole motivation of girls like to go out and dance and have a good time and, and when you're just out and just up tempo and just good music and feeling good and I mean that's what it's about like you made all those single girls feel good about being single again single single again yeah. did you write that yeah all right Shay 45 we yes. got some more with yes. Trina single, <laughs> single again <laughs> 